What you see here is an eye tracking sensor that knows with about this level of precision in real time where on the screen you're looking. Uh, we're launching that uh, this year together with Steel Series uh, to just create all these amazing new user experiences and uh, enrich the gaming experience for gamers. Uh, so one example of uh, how this is being used, you see a game here called Sun and Lore, uh, which are using eye tracking and they have it uh, built straight into the game. We'll launch it together with the Steel Series peripheral. Uh, in this game, uh, what's exciting is you do a lot of uh, supernatural powers, and the eye, using the eyes for that is great. There's a couple of basic functions here. Uh, one is called telekinesis, where you just look at a stone and then you concentrate on it for a while, and then it just flies up into space, and then you, you can hit a key to have the stone be thrown at an opponent or at an enemy within the game. And you also used your eyes for terraforming, uh, where you look in the landscape, and depending on where you look in the landscape, uh, the landscape will roll right in front of you. Uh, Sorry. Eye tracking is also great in existing games. We've got a couple of demos over here, how eye tracking is used in uh, uh, World of Warcraft, Starcraft, and it can be used in, and will be available in about 50 different uh, major game titles. We take existing games and we improve them a little bit uh, by adding new cool features. For example, in a game like uh, World of Warcraft, uh, you often spend a long time walking from uh, one city to the next, and that whole experience we can make a lot easier for you by just having the character automatically walk uh, wherever you're looking. Uh, finally, if you talk about your general Windows environment, eye tracking is very, very powerful because the fundamental things that you do all the time, you can just do a lot easier if uh, the computer knows where you're looking. So for example, if you want to open up a document uh, or launch a program amongst all the tiles in the Win8 start menu, you just look at that tile, the computer already knows what you're looking at and all that's left for you to do is just uh, hit a key on the keyboard and whatever you're looking at will fire up for you. Uh, if you want to scroll through a document, uh, as you open up a document, you just look towards the bottom of the document and it will scroll for you and always center the part of the document you're looking at. Zooming into a map is very easy. You naturally look anyway where you want to go and then you just use the hand to control the speed at which you zoom into or zoom out of a map, uh, making it much more effortless, natural and uh, uh, exciting to interact with your computer.